Ladies and gentlemen, after three rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. The judges score the contest 29-28, 30-27, and 30-27 for the winner by unanimous decision, Mark the Filipino Wrecking Machine. felt so good, you know, to uh, to love what you do and do what you love. You know, it's, uh, it doesn't feel like work, you know, but I have a first priority and that's my family, you know. You know, I'm going out on my own terms. I know what's important. Uh, they say you got to prioritize your schedule, but I think you have to schedule your priorities. And in my life, I'm so busy and I don't want to miss any special moments. And I haven't had this. I haven't, I haven't had the year I wanted to in mixed martial arts. I've lost, you know. But it's just a, it's just an analogy on my life, you know. You know, people might get hit by some unforeseen things. People might get diagnosed with cancer, with diabetes, but their life doesn't stop. They have to keep living. And that's what I did. I kept fighting. But now I don't want to miss any special moments anymore, you know. And that's what I'm about. And I promised my wife that I would stop when my, when my daughter, when my youngest daughter is in kindergarten. And uh, she's in first grade now. So, so yeah, I've had an awesome career. I've had a good career and MMA has given, given, given back to me and I'm so fortunate and grateful for that and blessed. I think it went well for me. Um, you know, he's a tough opponent. You know, he wasn't giving up. I hit him with some hard punches. He didn't go down. I was hitting him with some hard ground and pound shots. I was hitting him in the body and, and he kept coming back. That's what I wanted. I didn't want anybody to lay down for me. I don't want that. I wanted a fight and he gave me a fight and um, it was action packed. I believe it's, uh, it's gonna be hard to top that performance off uh, tonight, but uh, you know, it was, it, was a, it was a great fight. I, I believe it was action packed, what the fans wanted to see. I landed some hard punches and I heard some cheers. So um, that was awesome. That gave me some energy, so. It's just, it's just awesome to be here in the Philippines. This is where it all started for my family. I'm very, very Pinoy, I'm very, very Filipino from, from the food to the culture to the, to the uh, traditions. I'm very Filipino and so, you know, and, I, and I, thank, I, thank, I thank the Lord that it's here and it's finally here and I want to come back to be able to help the MMA scene here and, and help with wrestling, help with MMA and use my talents, gifts and abilities to leave a lasting impact and that's what I want to do here in the Philippines.